What's up everyone, this is Cybernet, and today we're opening up a uh, Pokemon 151 box. This is the, I believe, the uh, Thailand version of the set. I went on ahead and got this from Jockrod.com, because if you don't know, that's where they are. They're in Thailand. And uh, yeah, they actually had these boxes for a really good price. I want to say, uh, I think they were like under 40 or something like that. And the Japanese version of these boxes, I think, still goes for about 180 at the time of recording. So I thought it'd be fun to open this up. I mean, we know we're going to get this set in September. Yes, I normally open up Yu-Gi-Oh! and, but I, I do like to open up some other things too, like Digimon, and this is a really cool set. I mean, it's 151. I remember the Pokemon craze back in the day. It still feels like it's going strong on that, and uh, yeah, I mean, I do feel like this is a set made for me. So I debated on opening up a Japanese one, but at this price point, I mean, it's easy to uh, want to open up one of these, and uh, yeah, let's see what we get from it. And I, I will probably record uh, some of the English opening as well well, you know, whenever this is out in English and stuff, too, so let me know if you guys want to see that in the future, and yeah, we have plenty of Japanese openings on the way, too, for Yu-Gi-Oh, because, you know, Jokrod from this, so anyway, let's open it up. Give me some feedback, too, on this setup. I added a different, like, ring light up top, and uh, the way I have my webcam and all now, too, uh, there's a mess in the background. Just ignore that part. I'm sorry. I'm moving right now. So that part's a mess. I'm probably gonna add a green screen eventually to that, so I'll just be floating here, but... Uh, give me some feedback on, uh, what you guys think. Oh, it has a little tear here. Huh, that's interesting. I don't even think the Pokemon one does that. Weird. And I don't know the values, of course. Uh, like, the Thailand ones are probably cheaper, I'm gonna guess, than, the, like, the Japanese ones and all that, too. But, again, it, it gave me an excuse to open up Pokemon packs. And, uh, that, that, that's all we really need right here, right? I assume the God Pack thing is still possible and all that too is there tear yeah they do actually have a tear very nice i like the tears makes life easier okay so what we have we have our sense uh sense shrew almost a sense slash magnemite rattata which is adorable leftovers i believe and war turtle i don't know what the ratios are either suppose i don't even think we got a reverse did we also, excuse the dog barking in the background. I don't think you even get a reverse per pack. Interesting. I don't know, Japanese ones, you at least got that, kind of like with our English ones. And uh, you can get one that had the Master Ball pattern, which is kind of cool. Coughing. Rhyhorn. Goldeen and... Oh, we got uh, Alakazam. Oh, that's nice. Alakazam EX. That looks really cool, actually. I like that one quite a bit. And Victory Bell. Okay, so maybe reverses aren't a thing with these? That, that feels weird, you know? <laughs> we'll see. We have Pidgey. Electabuzz. Oh, here we go. Here's like one of the, I think it's illustration rare? I, I'm gonna say full art, basically. But yeah, of course, it is Alakazam again. So that's kind of funny. Back to back, really, on Alakazam. That is very pretty. I don't know... You know, if that, like, is the only one you get, or, or what. Again, the I, I definitely don't know the ratios with this. And Cloyster. It's easy to know the names of these Pokemon. Of course, these are the ones I grew up with. I really hope, too, that we get a set for Johto. I need some more Typhlosion love, basically. If you don't know, Typhlosion's my favorite Pokemon, so. Oh, we might have something. Oh, it's, uh, uh, Ammonite, or no, Amistar, excuse me, no, he evolved, <laughs> Amistar, I knew it was close, and I was like, no, 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 that's not it, <laughs> so there you go, and Hypno, and Primate, very cool, what else, of course, we have Mankey, then Kakuna, then Moltres, that's pretty easy, uh, Erica. I heard her card's like the really expensive one, evidently. The, of course, full art. And, uh, Executor. I don't know, is that? Yeah, that should be separate, probably. But I figured, too, this is also a good way for me to test out this setup. So let me know if you guys like it or what, too. I'm really hoping for some feedback on it. I'm trying to improve, you know, I'm trying to get rid of all that glare. Uh, Articuno. That's easy to remember. Dragonair. I like that. Yeah, even the Nidoran, Nidorinas, and all that. I think that one's Nidorina, and the other one's Nidoran. I get them confused. I know which one's the male and which one's the female. But still, I always like Nido King and Queen, though, too. Oh, 
Ooh, Char, uh, Charmander. Why oh, didn't I, I keep wanting to say the wrong names? I keep wanting to say like Charizard and everything. So I want to evolve everything. Uh, Charmander, though, that's really cool. I know we're supposed to get to that new set. Um, I don't know if I plan to open it. I probably will at least open a little bit of it because you know Charizard. I, I like Charizard. I like Firestarter Pokemon. What can I say? Um, but yeah, I, there's that new one coming out soon. At the time of recording, we'll probably open it up. It's like Obsidian something. I, I forget. But, uh, yeah, I like that Charmander quite a bit. It's a little bit different texture, so maybe it's different than, like, the Alakazam on that. I know there's one for, you know, the three starters and all. Sea King and, you know, Queen. Yeah, everything I'm wanting to evolve, basically. <laughs> Stop saying the name. It's like, no. <laughs> Not yet. All right, what do you got here? Oh, Starmie. Okay. I'll go with that. Oh, I like that Haunter. That's... Pretty cool, actually. Let me know, too, if I should get a Japanese box. I, again, I know I'm going to buy this set when it's in English. I mean, it, whether I made a video or not. So I figure, hey, might as well record it. Maybe someone will enjoy it. But let me know if I should get a Japanese one, too. Oh. Oh, we got Zapdos, too. I guess, yeah, that was the one we were missing. Yeah, except this one's the EX, of course. But I'll take Zapdos. That might be my favorite of the original three. Yeah, I feel like I like Zapdos the most. It's a hard choice. I do like all of them, though. I hit my chan. Oh, that kind of... There. I'm trying to keep things organized. Let's see what else is possible. I'd still like to get a Charizard. Oh, oh, that one's good. Poliwhirl. I remember seeing this one, too. I, I wanted this one, by the way. I, I really hope to get all these in English, especially, too. I, I feel like that's the, you know, the language I click the most for uh, in terms of Pokemon, of course. So, uh, yeah, still beautiful card. Like, seriously, that's such a good one. He had his community today in Pokemon Go. What was that about? Almost a week from when I'm recording this. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, Pinsir. Pinsir's one of my favorite Pokemon as well. I like Pinsir and Heracross. I think they're cool. I like some of those a bug Pokemon. Eevee. There you go. Can't go wrong with Eevee. Kabuto as well. Hate to name my favorite Pokemon, but I do know my originals. <laughs> so I'm not too worried about that. Oh, I like that, by the way. He's like reaching for some kind of berry or something. Tangula. I was gonna say an apple, but I guess technically in Pokemon World it'd be a berry. So we have my chop. Seal. <laughs> I like that one. Snorlax, of course, do their sand slash. I'd love to get that Erica. I know that's supposed to be the really expensive one for the Japanese pack. I mean, it's probably not as expensive as this, but I mean it's a beautiful card. So either way, who cares? Magneton. I feel like for Pokemon anyway, I collect for artwork <laughs> more than anything, you know? And whatever my favorites are. Oh, there we go. We got Jolteon. Can't go wrong with any evolution. I mean, instantly a fan of that. My wife and I collect like all evolution anything. If there's a toy of them, a figure, whatever, plushies. We, we picked them up, you know? Like a tongue. Oh. Oh, dude, we got uh, Ninetales. Oh, that's a nice looking one. Ninetales EX. I like that quite a bit. Well, there you go. That Persian's nice, too. That is really pretty. I like the I like the sparkle of that one, you know? Very nice. Okay. What else? The other thing that's not so good about this setup is I feel like I'm having to put my arms up the whole time. So you're kind of doing that whole thing. You ever do that exercise in gym where you're holding a basketball and you're kind of doing that straight out? I feel like I'm doing that while I'm opening up packs. So that is kind of a little tough. I'll have to figure that out. Building up my arm muscles probably though, right? I like that Growlithe. Growlithe is my wife's favorite Pokemon. Well, I guess technically Arcanine, but you know. Charmander. I like the original art too. Oh, there you go. Ivysaur. That's another one for yours, too. She, like, she's a Bulbasaur user. She's one of those they don't talk about, right? Let me know. Which of the three original starters do you choose? You know, which one's your favorite? For me, I know I'm that guy, but Charmander. I, I like the fire starters. I always go with the fire starter. Oh, uh, we have uh, Electrode. That one's kind of cool. 
but I, I gotta go with the fire starter every time. That's that's just how I roll. Like in any game, you know. He went the new ones, you know, with Scarlet and Violet. I went with uh Koi Coco, I believe is his name. I always forget his name. I hadn't got all the Scarlet and Violet like in my head just yet, but a lot of a lot of names. Then Oh, we got Mew! Mew EX! That's a good one. That's pretty cool. I like the alt art, too. That one's really pretty. But, uh, yeah, just the regular one is, uh, also very nice. You can't go wrong with that. Then, like, I think that's the bike path. I'm gonna guess. I, I can't read. You know, I can't read this at all. I, I barely read English. You guys know I, I miss say enough card names anyway, so. <laughs> Any other language? No way. <laughs> Alright. We got Drowsy. And, oh, we got a uh, Kabutops. I like that. That's another one of my old favorites. Kabutops just looks cool. You know, he's edgy. He's neat. It's like I also like Scyther, you know. I do hope that we get, like, another really cool full art. Because you want more from this set, honestly. The more you open of it, I can see why a lot of those Pokemon YouTubers are going crazy. Oh, and? Oh, dude! We actually got it! I, I think they're... Are there two Erica's? I might have to double check myself. I, I think this is the really good one you want to get, or there's another art. Either way, it's Erica. So uh, that's got to be good. I, I Again, if it was a Japanese one, I think I'd freak out more because I've seen the prices. And I think the ungraded, like Japanese one, of course, again, not this one. Um, I want to say they go for like 400. And then the graded one, you know, I guess you have to be like graded 10, I'm going to guess. I don't know if 9 is close either on that. Um, I think I've heard it was like 2000 So, yeah, a little, a little pricey. A little pricey. I like Erica, though, too. I, I, I get the hype, for sure. I don't know what this one. I mean, with uh, I'll, I'll have to ask, you know, Jokarod on that. Like, what do they think? But that's a pretty card, either way. I mean... I'm not doing this for value, <laughs> you know? It's for the pretty cards, so, you know, it's whatever to me. And especially, too, when you can buy a box for, like I said, I think I, I think it was about 40 or 30 is what I paid. I don't remember exactly. That's why I just said under 40. You can't really do wrong, right? That's two Yu-Gi-Oh! Tins, you know? <laughs> I, I'm not worried, you know? I don't have to worry about making money back. Oh, we got Arbok. Very nice. Arbok EX. I like this one. That is pretty, even though it's Arbok. I don't like snakes, okay? I'm a Texan that doesn't like snakes. I, I see them enough. Maybe that's why. I think we've done good, though, with this box. I mean, I got a Charmander. I got, you know, a couple Alakazams, really. Erica. I mean, uh, this feels like a good day. Magmar. That's cool. I wonder if they have a cool Magmar. Charmeleon. I'd love to get the Charmeleon. I want the whole, like, all the starters, though, of course. I mean... Those artworks are sick. <laughs> I can't wait to try to hunt those down, especially in English, you know, but yeah. Weedle. Oh, we got Gyarados. Can't go wrong with Gyarados either. Always a favorite. Always end up using one. If, if there's Gyarados possible. Got a car going by really quick. He heard about my Erica. All right. Squirtle. What's he got here? Kakuna. Tauros, Clefable even. Yeah, I really hope we start getting some Johto. So it's kind of like with Yu-Gi-Oh. You know, we see so much of the original series that I want to see more GX, 5Ds, and that kind of stuff. I feel that with Pokemon. Yeah, I love Gen 1. Don't get me wrong, but I want to see Gen 2 and 3 a little bit more. Oh, Mewtwo, that is pretty. Oh, and a cool Arcanine as well. Very nice. I like that Mewtwo. Mewtwo, still the strongest Pokemon ever. Don't at me. <laughs> I love Mewtwo's design. It's so good. But yeah, I, I, I like to see a little bit more. I, and I'm more like, whenever I started playing Pokemon, of course, I knew about it, of course, in the 90s and all that. I you know, I was born in 92, <laughs> so I, I knew all about it, but uh, I'm more of a Johto guy. Oh. Oh, oh, Mr. Mime. Yeesh. Unsighter, though. Okay, that makes it a little better. Mr. Mind. That's a pretty card. Don't get me wrong. I, I will say, beautiful card. Mr. Mind creeps me out. <laughs> I don't like Mr. Mind. Like the Pokemon movie that had the Detective Pikachu. That was a good movie. I enjoyed that. I actually rewatched that the other because my wife never saw it. Mr. Mind still scares me. Like, I, I just don't like him. And she's like, oh, he's kind of cute. No, no, he's not. No, he's not. <laughs> I don't like Mr. Mime. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to the one person out there that's, you know, maybe watching this video that's like, Mr. Mime's my favorite. 
He creeps me out. <laughs> I gotta say. You have to at least know what I'm talking about, you know? Just kind of creeps me out. Oh, I might have something. Oh, oh, that's cool. Chansey. It's like a chibi kind of looking one. I like that. Not bad at all. That's pretty. Or cute, really. And yeah, last pack. Okay, what can we can we end with the hollow? I guess I can say that with this. say with the Yu-Gi-Oh openings and stuff too. Let's see. I don't know. The only thing I I feel like I really miss the reverses of all things because I would like to get one of those Master Ball reverse cards. I know that's not a thing with this language, so I do kind of miss that. That kind of makes me want to get a Japanese one right there. But can we end with something cool? And, ah, uh, unfortunately not. But, I think I got a really good box. I mean, the Erica I feel like is really good. I don't remember if there's, like, two different Ericas or what. Um, either way, I'm happy. I mean, again, at that price point, you know, for, if I can pick up all these cards, good grief, man. Uh, for, for the price point I paid, I can't complain. You know, I just can't. So, beautiful artworks on these, and I just love the way these cards look. Again, I'm doing it for the artworks. I mean, I don't know what's necessarily good competitively. Of course, I don't know if it matters with this set. I think everyone's going for the artworks and nostalgia. So, understandable on that. Polyworld is so good. <laughs> and then, of course, uh, that Mr. Mime is really good. Charmander's nice, and I really like that Alakazam as well. Like, that is beautiful, for sure. But, yeah. Let me know what you guys think about this set and everything, and let me know, too, if I should actually open up uh, a Japanese version of the box. Again, I know it's way more expensive, but let me know. I mean, we have Bai, so let's let's get one through them. But as always, thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe and all that. Again, let me know feedback on this setup. That's, that's kind of the main reason for this video. And, of course, I will catch you guys later. See ya.